สวัสดีค่ะ Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to make catfish curry stir fry. It's super easy to make, and I will show you how step by step. And let's get started. Okay, so our first ingredient is catfish. I bought the fillet catfish b o l l e s and you just cut in chunk, in pieces, not too small and not too big. And then I use the all-purpose flour. You can use tempura flour. Um, this is just dry. Just um, just coat all the fish. Make sure you coat every single pieces. Next ingredients, I have a mixed vegetables. I have green beans in here, red bell pepper, and green bell pepper. You can pick any vegetable your choice, but this is just a basic stir fry vegetable. And then we're going to heat up our oil. You will need to put enough oil to cover, you know, good amount to cover our fish. Um, you want to wait until the oil is medium. Medium hot, not super hot, and not super low heat either. Just kind of um, medium, so it not burn your fish. And then you just put your fish in the oil and let it cook until it's golden brown. And then you take it out. And I have uh, like a paper towel um, ready to go, so it can kind of dry out some extra oil. Make sure you cook in batches, so you don't want to put all your fish in the oil at one time. So this way, all of your fish will be crispy on the outside and tender and juicy on the inside. And in the same wok, I just take out some of the extra oil. For stir fry the curry, you don't need a lot of oil. I would say about two tablespoon. Okay, next you will need to put in two tablespoon fried ginger curry paste. You can you can start with one one tablespoon first. It depends on how spicy you can handle. For me, this is still not spicy enough for me, but you don't want it to be super spicy anyway for this type of curry. Then um, you need put in the vegetables of your choice, and you see it's a little dry, so you add more oils or a little water. You don't want to a little go a long way. You don't want it to be like a soup. So just a little by little. Remember, it's called stir fry. And when the vegetable is a little bit tender, I like my crispy, so I'm not gonna wait really long. Then, then you will need to start put all the seasoning in, and you is, you will need to wait until the sauce is a little thicken before you put all the sauce in. Okay, and then you start adding two tablespoons of oyster sauce. Hi, 
half tablespoon of fish sauce. One and a half tablespoon of sugar. And then you need to mix it all together. Make sure you taste it. Um, if you want a little bit salty, you put more fish salt. If you want more little sweet, you put more sugar. And make sure you have enough juice before you put fish in. If you it's a little dry, you add a little bit of water before you put your fish in because after you put your fish in, your fish will soak up all the curry, goodness, yummy sauce. And then after that, then you put a couple lamb leaves in there. And that's it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let's be. Please give me a thumb up and subscribe for more video. And I will see you next time. Bye.